What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have Jadavion Clowney through the years. Now, we can kick things off in NCAA 2012. Now, I know he wore number seven right here. I believe this is him. He's a big freshman. He's the only freshman on the defensive line. He's wearing 97, which, of course, is close to seven because it has seven in it. And, again, he's a freshman. The measurables, 6'6", 247 pounds. It all adds up if you ask me. I, it all adds up. So, I believe this is him. So, in NCAA 2012, he's 83 overall with 84 speed, 80 strength, 85 acceleration, 85 tackle, 80 for his hip power, 84 power move, 68 finesse move, 86 block shit. Now, for his freshman season, he would total a grand total of 36 tackles, 17 solo, 19 assisted, 12 tackles for loss, 8 sacks, and 5 forced fumbles. And they'll get him in the backfield. This defensive end just showed us why he's much more than just a pass rusher. Tipped away. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. The score here in Columbia, South Carolina 10, Florida 7. This guy is mostly used to stop the run, but here he showed that he's not too bad against the pass either. So let's move on to NCAA football 2013 where he comes in at 91 overall as a true sophomore. He also has 77 speed, 75 strength, 92 acceleration, 85 tackle, 81 hit power, 93 power move, 87 finesse move, and an 88 block shed. His stats look like this. He had 54 total tackles, 40 solo, 14 assisted. He had a grand total of 23 and a half tackles for loss, 13 sacks, three forced fumbles, and one fumble recovery and he tackles him hard at the 25 yard line Brad, not only did they give up the sack here their quarterback just got hit and hit hard if i'm an offensive coordinator and especially an offensive line coach i'm getting a hold of my offensive line making sure these guys are on the same page and they've got to take more pride in taking care of their quarterback than that play right there and that's what happened to this offense the last time they were out it's not just the quarterback's job to try to get this offense going i think it starts up front veteran offensive line see what kind of leadership they have to try to change this thing around now let's move on to NCAA 14. He is 99 overall as a junior, his last year in college. 85 speed, 91 straight, 94 for his acceleration, 92 tackle. We all remember that hit he put on that Michigan running back. He has 99 hit power, 70 power move, 99 from Ness move, and a 94 for his block. And of course, that hit came in his last game as a sophomore in the bowl game for South Carolina. For his senior, or for his junior season, I should say, he only had 39 total tackles, 11 assisted, 28 solo, 11 and a half tackles for loss, just three sacks, and still had one forced fumble. Remember, you don't have to go for it on fourth down. The last time you had the football, you went for it on fourth down and you didn't convert it. Just think about this. If you move the ball into your opponent's territory and you want to take a chance that it makes sense to go for it on fourth down, I understand that and I get it. But when you're in your own territory and it's fourth down and five or longer, just consider. going to be sacked for a loss. He has one job on passing situations. Get to the quarterback. And he did that job very, very well on that play. He would finish his South Carolina career with a grand total of 129 tackles, 47 tackles for loss, 24 sacks, and 9 forced fumbles. Of course, he was the number one overall pick in the draft. And for his career as an NCAA character, he is a career average of 91 overall. Now for the Houston Texans in Madden 15, he is 83 overall, 88 speed, 79 strength, 92 uh, acceleration, excuse me. He also comes in with 86 tackle, 95 for his hip power, 94 power move, 85 finesse move, and an 87 for his block shed. Now he only played in about four games. He had a grand total of seven tackles, three for loss, and zero QB hits, zero sacks, zero forced fumbles, and zero fumble recoveries. It's going to get set in the slot for the snap. Boyer is going to take it from the gun. And he's forced to the ground. Well, that time the quarterback is sacked on the third down, and that's, of course, that's bad. But the good thing is, 
He did not try to force the football down the field and get the turnover. Eight in the backfield. The Browns take it from the 23. Draw. Bounties all over that offense and brings him down. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. So in Madden 15, he was 83 overall as a rookie. In Madden 16, he's 78 overall as a second year player. 87 speed, 79 strength, 90 acceleration, 77 tackle, 93 hit power, 96 power move, 80 for his finesse move, and an 82 for his block shed. Now, for this season, he would total a grand total of 40 tackles, 27 solo, 13 assisted, 8 tackles for loss, 4 and a half sacks, and he had a grand total of 18 QB hits. Take it from the 28. Throws the pass. Probably should have had that one, but it goes incomplete. Sometimes you wonder how can they drop passes in the NFL, college football, or high school because the gloves these receivers wear, they are magnificent when it comes to helping you catch the football. So that's a big drop. When you get open, you got to make it. First down at the 42. Bounties all over the ball carrier. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Pass with a dime defense. Will go ground. And Gore is brought down. Ends up picking up one. Third long situations. A lot of coordinators in this. So now it's time to move on to Madden 17. And the Madden 17 is 83 overall again. 87 speed, 79 strength, 89 acceleration, 78 tackle, 91 for his hip power, 84 power move, 78 finesse move, and a 91 block shed. He would have a grand total of 52 tackles, 16 for loss, 6 sacks, 1 fumble recovery, 3 or 1 Force fumble, excuse me, 3 fumble recoveries, and a grand total of 17 hits on the QB. An extra defender in the secondary now on third down. Here's Carr. And unable to connect on the long pass. It falls down incomplete. We know it's not an easy job to go out and catch passes when people are trying to tackle you and knock the ball away. But the bottom line is, that's a pass he's got to have and a pass he should have caught. Throwing his car on third down. And he'll just toss it away. So he throws it away, and that brings up fourth down. And not to get too overcritical there, because he knows what he's doing, but his shoulders looked a little off kilter there when he threw that. I don't think you've been overly critical there. You're just analyzing it, and he gets those shoulders right. That pass will go from incomplete to complete. Madden 18, he is up to 86 overall with 87 speed, 79 strength again, 89 acceleration again, 83 tackle, 86 for his hit power, 87 power move, 75 finesse move, and 87 block shed. He would have 59 total tackles, 41 solo, 18 assisted. He would also have 21 tackles for loss, 9 and a half sacks. He had 2 force fumbles, 3 fumble recoveries, 1 went for a TD, and he had 21 QB hits. They begin with a run by Fournette. Only a couple there as he'll be brought down about the 28. Every snap, another nice job there to force him into the And he's going to go down. The Texans come at him and able to bring him to the ground. Pass protection. Get lower than that defensive lineman so you can keep your balance and keep him away from your guy trying to throw the ball. Madden 19, we see his highest overall rating so far, 91 overall with 87 speed, 84 strength, 90 acceleration, 
85 tackle, 86 for his hit power, 89 power move, 77 finesse move, and an 88 for his block shed. He would have a grand total of 47 tackles. Nine of them were assisted, 38 were solo, 16 tackles for loss, nine sacks, one forced fumble, three fumble recoveries, and of course, one went for a TD, and he also had 21 QB hits again. against them as this game goes on. Played up with a screen, so. Used to a bit more scoring. This feels almost like a well-pitched game in baseball on both sides. And this turn. So, so far in Jadavion Clowney's NFL career, or Madden career, I should say, he is a grand total of 84.2 overall so far in his Madden career. That's going to do it, you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you really did enjoy it, leave a thumbs up. If you liked it so much, share it with your friends and your family. And until we meet again, my friends, I hope the rest of your day is the best of your day. Y'all stay safe out there. It's a crazy world. Peace. Love.